Hello curls, it's Yolanda Renee and today we are going to be doing a video on how to take down your box braids. You're going to need scissors. Oh shoot, they're stuck. <gasps> how the happened? Oh my god. I think I super glued my scissors. Alright, so yeah, we're going to need scissors. We're going to need our fingers. That's all you're going to need at the moment, but we'll come back once we have all of these down. Alright curls, see you in a bit. So I've taken out all of my little mini twists that I did to um, in install these braids. Hopefully I didn't miss any. And my hair feels so amazing, you guys. It is juicy. The only problem I had was the back and kind of like the sides right here. And this is where I loaded up my edges with gel while I had the braids installed. So what I'm doing is I'm just putting globs and globs of coconut oil like directly on those areas I did cover saturate my hair with coconut oil all over but I'm going back in on my edges and just putting a whole bunch and not even worrying about it melting I'm just putting it on there eventually it will melt um, but not so much the front it's the back like I'm not even going to show you guys because it feels gross but um, the hair is pretty much kind of matted back there from where the gel ended. Um, so as you can see, I have tons and tons of coconut oil on my hair. And basically this is my pre-poo um, before I start washing my hair. Um, but we will get into my wash routine in a different video. So in my initial install video, I definitely um, recommended my technique. I am claiming this technique. Yes, I am. And it was my first time doing it. It just made sense to me. And now that I have taken this down and saw how easy it was, like, knowing that you know it didn't do any damage to my hair as of yet um so i definitely recommend the two strand twist technique it definitely protects your hair i think it stops a lot of um breakage and shedding it makes the hair stronger because all of the strands are actually twisted together to just make them stronger um so and it definitely helped me blend the hair with the synthetic hair like i had no problems with little flyaways or anything and honestly I kind of think that I could have washed the braids themselves and I wouldn't have any like peekaboo little curlies sticking out but I wasn't chancing it so I just basically just did a um a spot wash just on my scalp like a co-wash I mean 
But anyway, I hope you guys um, enjoyed this quick video. And stay tuned for my wash day because that's what's coming up next in a different video, of course. And I'm going to be washing my hair with Eden Body Works products. So um, hopefully you will come back and see that. So now that my hair is saturated with the coconut oil, um, just like in my Back to the Basics series when I tell you about um, pre-poo, um, after you have your hair crazy saturated with, um, with your favorite oil blend then you can just put a plastic cap on your head or you can do like me I like using just a bag <laughs> like, so I'm just going to keep this bag on my head for like 15 minutes or more whatever I feel like keeping it on for but this will just help with the warming up process because it's like your body temperature heats up the oil and let it do its thing it's kind of cute it's like <laughs> but yeah I'm gonna keep this on and then I'm going to start my wash day well actually wash night because it's nighttime <laughs> all right girls thank you so much for watching I'll see you in my next video Bye.